Before the UNSC Spartan members arrive to the field, they need to prepare with the right equipment and armor depending on the situation, or just to make a fashion statement. From Mega and Halo, this is the Bizarre Battleground. Sort of a follow-up to the UNSE armor packs before, these 2023 sets feature two Spartan figures, two AIs to go with them, and a small build to interact with. The set includes two gray base plates, a bulldog shotgun in gray, the introduction of the updated sidekick pistol, thank goodness, in dark gray, a brand new pulse carbine in purple, and a plasma pistol in purple. There's also the two printed AIs that can be held in their hands with the yellow fret and blue cirque. As for the build, I love this small custom shielded turret. It's simple with two gunners and handles for a figure behind it. Not only that, parts of this can be placed on the Outrider's Mongoose. Before we get to the armor, let's show the figures as they come packed. Seems we can't get away from the poster child, the UNSC Spartan Mark 7, which is weird. The minty green armor with the white hat looks like whipped cream on a Starbucks drink. He has the modern joints with a gray undersuit, gray details on the helmet, and a gold visor. With the Mark 7 helmet, he has the basic Mark 7 shoulders and jack plate chest. As for options, you get an additional pair of shoulders originally from the package chief, an optional default torso, or the ordnance pack. As for helmets, you still get an out-of-place white head, but you can choose from the Anubis or swap with the Hermes helmet. Then there's the Spartan Vesta, and yes, it's right this time. The colors work better here and are consistent with the helmet. In the modern articulation, it has the gray undersuit and tan armor with gray details and metallic paint for the visor. With the Vesta helmet, he has matching security shoulders and relic caress torso. For the armor, you can swap the basic belt for the assault piece with unpainted ammo. That matches the assault torso, as well, there's the shared default shoulders. As for the helmets, you can switch to the trailblazer or the new flanker design. As a bonus, there's a new rubber ammo belt that can wrap around the basic one already placed. I like the idea, but it looks too big on the sides. Maybe it works in Texas? I gotta admit, I usually like minty colors, but it doesn't really suit here with the white head. However, I love the small turret build, the AIs, the new weapons, and the tan on the Spartan really fits, so I think it's all worth it. This video is brought to you by Boss Brickster. Check out the site, socialize with fellow Mega Constructs fans, and even redeem points from the website for Mega Constructs products. Check out the affiliate link down in the description below.